Hello and welcome back to this Trails of Cold Steel Let's Play with me, SLJ RPG. In the last episodes, we learned that there's some goings on with some fake park or some park rangers here at Lumia Nature Park, and we are on our way to go see what is happening. We also did some other side quests. We defeated a flying monster. Lumia Nature Park, huh? Yeah, it really does feel a little out of place sitting smack dab in the middle of farmland, as far as the eye can see. We need more of these things. Uh, we also helped someone find their wallet, but it may have had some religious significance in ages past. It feels like this is where we got to be for now. Perhaps it was a place where the animists of ancient times chose to enshrine the spirits of the forest. There's a place much like that in my hometown. Yeah, there's one in mine too. There we go. That park ranger made it sound like there would be people here. If they really are the culprits, maybe they've run away already? They're most probably in another place. Hmm. This woodland is too dense to reliably into it whether anyone awaits within. Yeah. Hmm, what's this? It's... A bracelet. A bracelet? Hmm. How did a bracelet come to be in a place such as this? Feels like it's that's showing that it is them. Just as I thought. This bracelet has the same design on it as the ones that the merchant from the capital was planning on selling. Really? You're sure? Positive. There's not a doubt in my mind that it was designed by the same person. Yep, yep, yep. Care to give a second opinion on that, Laura? I'm hardly qualified to weigh in on recent trends, but there do seem to be a number of similarities between this bracelet and the merchant's goods. Dun dun dun. So the fact that it's here means... Yeah. It's extremely likely the culprits we're looking for are inside this park. Sure seems that way to me. Certainly does. Hmm. <laughs> So it seems only likely, or fair. It only opens from the inside. I suppose that leaves us little choice. Here comes the big old sword. Are you going to destroy it? Uh, will you be able to? The lock seems quite solid, but my sword should be strong enough to... Wait. Can you lockpick it? I'll do it. I can get it done more quietly. Oh? Really? Well, what are you going to do? Use wind. The eight leaves, one blade school's fourth form. Autumn leaf cutter. Hmm? Huh? Easy money. Seriously? Wow, you cut it right in two. I did, thankfully. Spectacular. It's an honor bearing witness to one of the skills of the Eight Leaves School. <laughs> Thanks, but I'm still more or less a beginner. Anyway, we don't have much time left. Let's head inside and see if we can find them. Right. Let's do this. We need to find them before the sun starts to set. Yes, because we got our train. Looks like we can still make it after all. Excellent. Come then. We must make haste. Indeed. We have some time. There's this bad boy here. Getting us an EP charge 2, which is probably going to be very, very handy. But let's make our way into Luminaire Park. As we go, find ourselves a healing station almost immediately, which is, of course, very, very handy. There's tons of little stone monuments in here. Is there a graveyard? Yeah. What do you think they're supposed to be? It's pretty dark. I imagine they were made by the animists in this province. Let me heal, for fuck's sake. I do like the active time things. It's a lot better than skits in the Tales series. But, feels like we've only got one way to go, which is forward. So we see our first enemy here. I welcome all challenges. My turn. So let's go ahead and use an awesome leaf cutter on these two. There. Nice, nice, nice. My turn. 
Flamberg. Use our detector. These jelly shrooms. Massive solemn fungus paralyzes organisms approaching it. Seems fairly easy to me. See that guy off. Oh, we should have done the arts. That's fine. This guy's got a burn on as well, so that guy's going to die pretty quickly. So we'll take out the one where it isn't. I can do this. Shoot on this guy. I did upgrade some weapons. I could only open one new slot on Reen, so it's nothing too crazy. But this should be fairly easy here. One, as soon as this comes to his turn, it's going to attack. That's fine, but it will burn itself, and then Reen fairly simply can just deal it off there. That's that. Let's keep moving. Take all of the stuff we can. Nice. Still, there's these random wooden blocks in the middle of a, of a nature reserve, of course. There must be. There is only one way. Ooh, this looks interesting. We we'll attack it there. Right. First things first, detector it. Enemy attack patterns. I've got it. A blade horn, a large insect with a horn resembling a blade. Here we go. Pretty, uh, pretty obvious, and then late weak to pierces, which is fine. When in doubt, look to Laura. Laura does seem to help help out a fair amount, but it's my turn. Right, my turn. Do a quick run through the forest. Find ourselves against another jelly horn. Don't know where these What's things' eyes are, which is the interesting part. I can do this. They're somewhat weak to flames. Burn. Here we go. Try and take out these two. Right. Attack this guy because way more likely to come back here. Take out the one. This guy moves. He has to do a little bit of fighting on Tareen, but that's fine. The burn should give this a fairly decent sing, but then if we do another awesome leaf cutter, get the slash, get the joint, and then attack. Ah, that's annoying. Just get a fireball ready, even though I don't think we're going to have to use it. Easy money. Everyone is. Reen's almost at level 12 as well. I'm not sure when we unlock stuff, but a whole bunch of Sepith for everyone's very good. We can definitely use that to unlock some stuff. Smash up some barrels. Get ourselves a mint drop, which is very good. It's my turn. Right, right. Go. I keep on doing the wrong one to run. <laughs> Another chest here. A Curia Balm. Okay, there's a lot of them here. Sasa Panda is a new one. Just gonna lock in, and then we're gonna use the S. See if we can hit as many of these as possible. We we'll use the one where we can hit three. Easy money. Use there. awesome leaf cutter. To also give the crit to someone else. I can do this. Turn to flames. Do the flame bug. Burn. Take him out. Get the crit to Reen. Perfect. Easy That's money. That. Let's keep moving. One point six. Gotta love it. As we get levels up for absolutely everyone as well, which is again all good. We're gonna learn any new skills. <laughs> I've only no skills. I'm waiting for when we're going to eventually get our S breaks, but apparently it's not anytime soon. Before we go that way, we're going to head this way. Oh, a treasure chest. Indeed. Watch out, guys. It's my turn. Turn to flames. Flame bug this guy at the back. Burn. My 
turn. Autumn Leaf got her on these two. Go. Slashes off. I'll take you up. We'll take it. Right. Hey. Take out the one nearest to us. Right. Hey. Take out your boy there. <clears throat> gonna attack Reen, which is fine. It's gonna hurt itself with the burn. This guy missed. Are we gonna get a counter? We don't. That's fine. We're doing an Orphan Leaf Cutter against there. the two of them. Go. Then, with the assist. I'll bet you up. Pretty simple money. Okay, that was tough. Nice work, though. We're nowhere near the Link 2, but we will be at some point, I'm sure. So, what have we got here? Some citrus <laughs> bottle. Oh, we got a whole bunch of stuff. We're going to put the coral bracelet there. We're going to put the marble bracelet. No, we're going to put the citrus bottle here. We're going to put the marble bracelet here. And then we're going to put the Picard plush there. Yeah, this park covers a lot more area than I was expecting. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty gigantic. <laughs> Where? Where's the treasure chest? Oh, look at that big boy. I recognize them from, uh, from Crossbell. So let's go ahead. That looks like a strong one. Be careful. <laughs> it oh, does look yeah, rather big. There. Here we go. Okay. That's three of them. There. That is not handy. <laughs> Okay, they are strong. It's not exactly ideal, but that's fine. Let's go ahead and use a golden sphere where we can. Let's go. We need to use a detect, obviously. Analyzing enemy attack patterns. What are they weak to? Analysis complete. Fire seems to be the main one. Huh? We've got the golden sphere here. Is it gonna blind any My of them? Turn. Maybe not. I'm just gonna attack regularly now there's a panda in there apparently and some more fuck me there's so many of them okay this is going to be a difficult fight so that's a panda coming in big boy coming Go. in there ultimately cut her i can do this Feels like that's the best one to do. My turn. And then attack regularly the Go. beetle. Off guard. I've got you. Still got our heat wave. Should take out some of them. Almost, almost. My turn. Keep it up, do the resounding lullaby here. Give it a quick defense up. Ooh. Wow. Okay. Go. There. Do this. It should help take out some of them. Now Slash. I'll pick you up. It's my turn. Do a blessed there. arrow. Heal up Arcee a little bit. You have my thanks. thanks. Nice. My turn. Use the Earth Cleaver. Doesn't even take out the one. The crit, not good. Oh, but it missed. Counter. Nice. Sky is dead on arrival. Counter. And taken out. I'm actually going to do this so I make sure I hit both of them. Take out the beetle, and then we could simply just fuck up this guy, I believe, now. He's going to get an EP heal of 50, but that's not going to be an issue. He misses again. Cool. Counter once again. I can do this. Is Pierce is going to do anything. This would have been one to handy to have the uh, the S-break on, but... Here we go. 
the more you know. It's going to get one hit away. That's fine. It's my turn. But this bonus critical should definitely see it off. There we go. Nice. Right. Let's keep on moving. 1.7. Feels like a good time. 1. Point. Angel reach level 2. So, recover from a KO. Fortuna has been learned. Automatically recover KO. Activ recover 25% CP once battle. Active into battle. Brave reach level 2 too. Strength is, would hopefully be ranged into 2 turns of 25%. Can't complain about that. No crafting, but that was a big step up for us in our little challenge. So let's head to Luminaire Park 2. I can see a treasure chest there. Oh, there's a stream here. This seems like a nice spot. Easily done with these triple. My turn. Take out both of them when we can. Go! I'll get you up. I can do it. Surely we're gonna get a line attack. Go up to rank too soon. That would be cool. I've kind of kept these guys on the same ones the entire time for a reason. We should keep going. Grab what's in here. A Tierra bomb. Right. Hmm. My turn. Here we go. Ooh, this is a new guy. <laughs> A blade pincer instead of a sword, it looks like. Uh, we'll just attack. They got pierce off as a thing. They're going to have a zero arts. They're not really doing anything with it. We're going to get a counter off. We'll attack this guy. With our lines. A detector here. Ultimately going to be the easiest fortune. Slash. These things seem to be weak to everything that we do. That's fine. 280 is not the end of the world. Boom. That takes care of them. We'll take it all. Right. My turn. Right. I've got this. Take them in drop. Bring it on. My turn. Use a heat wave there. I can do this. Let's start using some of these ants. Let's go. Of course. Hey. Take one out. Who's it going to be aimed towards? It's going to be aimed towards the other one. This should mostly see it away. Not good. Easy money. Okay, that was tough. Nice work, though. Nice work indeed. Grab our reward. An airstrike. I I'm wondering if I should. Hmm. We're gonna put Frost Edge on, right, right. just to add a little bit I've of water elements to our attacks, because I think it's probably something that we're missing. Uh, we'll aim up this way first. A stimulant. Nothing there. That looks like a strong one. Be careful. A worthy adversary. This feels like it's the best idea. Anyway, I can hit all of them. We'll take these three. Nice. Here we go. Definitely needed. I can do this. 
My turn. Attack. Hopefully we get some sort of buff off. We don't. It's okay. Slap down. Missed. Counter. Nice. Get the slash. Get the assist. God damn it. Get the counter off, please. No, it doesn't. That's fine. But Reen can simply see off the ending. Set him. Easily see off the ending, guy. Coral ring. Always feels like it's a good idea to attach. Prevent seal. We've already got that on the coral bracelet. We'll put that on to thing. The proxy puppet's okay. I can do this. My turn. Right. Here we go. Take out the blades. My turn. Seemingly weak against everything. It's my turn. Certainly weak against Pierce. Fire. Nothing happens there, though. Huh? Nice. HP heals, okay. We're going to miss. We're going to get the counter off. We're not. That's okay. We'll see them all up. We're really collecting CP. I need to get more CP onto uh, right. Laura. Let's keep on moving. I'm sure we'll get the chance. I'll get the chance to. I, can do this. I believe there's three zones right. to this area, so. Here we go. Grab what's in here. Celestial balm, obviously very, very handy. My favorite item in the game, it must be said. So we head to Nature Park area part three. Just how deep does this forest go? A lot. Very must deep. Be pretty far in now. I'd imagine we're almost there. Almost found our way. Let's try this way first. <laughs> Use awesome leaf cutter here. It's my turn. Turn to flames. Use a flame bug. So strikes and pierces. My turn. May as well just take out the one. Don't give them the chance to even attack. Keep them somewhat together. Oh, we fainted. That's really annoying. Turn to flames. Use the flame bug. Use the link tank. gonna take the one out that's in flames anyway. Here we go. This guy's gonna die pretty quickly. My turn. Hey. Right. Pretty simple. Oh, we did it. Indeed we did. Rena's level 13 as well. Right. Any sign of an S break coming? No, okay. That's annoying. But okay. It's my turn. My turn. My turn. Go. Oh wow. Take. Here we go. This one's pretty big. Whatever's they're guiding here is going to be pretty goddamn strong. We'll see if it comes as one big final attack. It's my turn. Of course. Too slow. Everyone's going after Reen. One down. Right. Two down. Oh, we did it. If it's not going to go straight to another battle, it's not. Right, I'll see. clear these guys off and I'll be with you in a sec. Yes, it is a treasure chest. There was about five battles there. We've got a golden sphere. It's pretty good. So let's make our way back round. To where we were, see where we are. We want to fight everything, obviously. That seems to be the way up, but let's try and go this way. Another chest chest. Get a terror bomb. I'll take it. Enemies ahead. My 
turn. Nothing too worrying. Let's take out the Sussapanda. Off guard. I got you. My turn. We'll do this and take out the panda as well. It's my turn. <laughs> Need to heal up some uh, magic onto your boy. But I don't think that's going to be too much of an issue. On your boy, onto Elisa. We're very close to that link. I want that link level to go up before we fight anything, to be honest. But I don't know if I'm going to get that opportunity. It's a treasure chest. As we find ourselves another treasure chest. Watch out, guys. Okay. Right. Resounding beat Keep for everyone, everyone first. Right. Got a free arts. We're just going to use Fireball on here. Don't think RC is really the one to do it. I mean, we could use the S-Break. Feels probably like the smart thing to do. Take those big boys out. Nice. Here we go. I'm going to try and take out the guys at the back because the other ones have got... They missed. That's really annoying. Get the assist. Right. Two burns. My turn. There. Use some autumn leaf cutters everywhere. We go, take out the one with the burn. My turn. Even if it attacks, it's gonna It's my turn. Get the assist. Boom. And then just smack the final one off. Evil will fall before my blade. Of course it will. And then what did we get as a reward here? Heat wave. Interesting. These are things I've already purchased, so I've got a fair amount on. But I you know what I am gonna do. I don't know if that is a good idea. Who knows? We're gonna keep as is. Right, of course. Right. I don't think I've got anything else to fight in this area. I think I've successfully taken on everything. I'll quickly double check here. Oh, some boxes. A reviving bomb is hella useful. So it feels like this is the way to go. Charging station. There certainly is. We must be in the most remote reaches of the park. We certainly are. So let's go ahead and grab this. Can we customize weapons at all? We've already got all of these. Uh, let's rest first and foremost. I'm aiming to do the. Um, I want to open slots before anything else, to be honest. Already got four open there, so let's open up this one. Ah, uh, you fucking asshole, making me do that one. Can only do certain ones. That one we can't do anymore. God damn it. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Uh, modify an exchange. So let's go ahead and put some orbs or quartz into where we do now have some free spaces. So we've got a free one here. Breath feels like a good one to have. So that's what I'm going to put there. Here I can only put in Mirage Magic, which is fine. So let's go ahead and put the Golden Sphere there. And I think this is probably a good place to say, if you've enjoyed this, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time, where we face off with the Park Rangers.
Peace. <laughs>